What's good, YouTube? It's your boy RTS here, 47 Lifestyle. Today, we're actually be doing something different. Um, I was watching some do it yourself, like D do I can't even talk right now, but DIY videos of like how to like bleach and distress hats and stuff like that. Just fashion tips because I like I'm big into fashion, you know, I like a lot of Nike, as you can see. But yesterday, I went to uh, a local store. Uh, Kohl's Shout out to them um, And I bought this shirt So me being as an artist I really like All types of music And I went and I got this shirt And I'm gonna It'll be my first time ever doing this So it'll be a tutorial video This time But as I try to lay this out Flat and nice as can be you know, get any size you want, medium size, large. Any type of t-shirt will work. Preferably, it'll have to be black, you know, for the tie-dye to come out. And uh, at the end of the video, I'll show you how, um, I'll show you through the steps. At the, but at the end of the video, I'll show you uh, my results. Uh, but this is the shirt that I got. As you can see, it's Johnny Cash, you know, living legend. It will always be a living legend to me. But Folsom Prison is actually my favorite, favorite song by Johnny Cash. So that's why I got this shirt. And it was like 20 bucks, 22 bucks, you know. But uh, it's going to be worth it. It's going to be well worth it. It's going to be dope. So stay tuned um, for the results. Peace. What's good, everybody? It's your boy RT's back again. All right, so the three things that you're going to need, you're going to need uh, some Clorox bleach. You're also going to need um, a spray bottle. So for starters, I actually found an empty spray bottle already. And what I'm going to do, I'm actually just going to take the Clorox and put some of it in here and then use the spray bottle. And then also you're going to need some paint brushes to do whatever you want to do with the shirt. You know, you could splat it, you know, like you're painting or something. Um, but you could also, hang on one second. A few moments later. All right, so what you're gonna do now is you're just gonna take your Clorox. You're gonna do this real quick. Take some of the Clorox. Make sure you have your shirt. Don't get your. And right, you wanna be really careful because bleach stains really bad. So. I drip in your bitch like water. I splash on your bitch with the water. I feel like I'm 21 Savage. I pull up and fuck on your daughter. That should be good right there. We're gonna take this. Put the top back on. Look at the flick of the wrist. Bell. Look at the flick of the wrist. Okay. So now you got your spray bottle, right? So make sure you want it works. Wait one second. Alright, so the bleach works, okay? Shake it up just a little bit. Now, we're gonna go upstairs in the garage, find a place where you won't get bleach all over the place. Or even on yourself, um, where you want to lay your shirt on a flat surface. Um, so we're gonna be going outside. So stay tuned. All right. So now that you got, you know, you got your shirt, you know, uh, that's what it looks like outside. You know, you want to see what you're getting the spots at and everything. I had to put some weight on the shirt because it was blowing away because of the wind. It's pretty nice out today. Did not expect it. But you're also gonna need a bucket of water. So we're gonna go get that water right now. Turn on the holes real quick. Make sure that's... All right, that should be good. So we'll go back over here, and yeah, the water's spraying. All right, just so gonna put the water right in there. Yeah. Make sure you get enough water for the dye to get out. I'm gonna put that over there. Gotta turn the hose back off. I want to flood the yard. Alright guys, so we got all the supplies. We got the bleach. We got the shirt. And we got the bucket of water to stop the dye from just keep going all over and to keep, you know, because you want to get the dye a certain color. So here we go. Um, this is going to be, you're just going to take your bleach, shake it up a little bit. Start spraying. Wherever you want the bleach at, spray it all over. 
wherever you want the bleach at. See, you can see it's already turning colors, you know. You can even do a lot to where you want the most. And it's already... And now, I already like how it's coming out. It's coming out really good. So just going to let that sit for a little bit, you know, maybe a little bit right here. And I don't mean that much. Now, what you're going to do... See, I love the way it's coming out right now. This is amazing. I figured it was going to come out just like this, too. So, yeah, this is dope. Okay. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to put in some water right now to stop the bleach. You know what? I'm going to keep... Yeah. That looks good. That looks really good. Now, I'm just going to... Okay. I'm going to put it in the water right now. Because it's, it's going. So you just put it in water. water. Put your shirt in water. water. It stops the water. bleach from going. Water. Water. I drip in your bitch like water. I splash on your bitch with the water. Let that sit in there for water. a bit. Water. Water. And then uh, I'm going to hang it up to dry. So stay tuned for more. It's going to be dope. So guys, thank you for watching the video. Like, comment, and share. Subscribe. Please share to all your friends on social medias. If you want to try and do a shirt like this, it's pretty dope. But this is going to be the outcome. This is it right here. You know? It's dope. I think I think I did a really good job on it for my first time. I love this part, especially right here. It's kind of got like a striped look to it. So what we're going to do is just set it up, hang it to dry, and that's it. Johnny Cash, Folsom Prison Blues Edition. Enjoy. I hear the train a coming, it's rolling around the bend, and I ain't seen the sunshine since I don't know when. I'm stuck in Folsom Prison, and time keeps dragging on. But that train.